you. I know it's been months since you've seen this. It's been probably about three months now. But I did say I was only going to make videos that were interesting and interesting for myself. And I'll spin the camera around. You'll probably realize I'm at the Bund in Shanghai. I've been in Shanghai for about one month now, but I've been working. But there's a big typhoon, so there's a level three warning out for a typhoon. And so maybe in May, for I'd come down to the Bund to check it out. It's not actually due until tomorrow, so this is the calm before the storm. I'll also record what it's like tomorrow. And um, it's just quite creepy. There's like big announcements. I don't know what the announcements are, but there's announcements. There's hardly no one here. I bet if you've been to the Bund, this is probably the quietest you've ever seen the Bund. Because it's probably not the best idea to come to a riverbank when there's a big typhoon coming. Apparently, it's a level three warning, which I think is the second highest in China. And there's been a lot of flooding around the central area of China already. So I probably shouldn't be out here. But it's the day before the storm. It's not due until tomorrow. But it seems like a lot of people are taking precautions already. There's like sandbags out, hardly no one's out. You normally have thousands of people here at the Bund. There's no cruise ships or anything on. I think these are just for... I'm not sure what these are. It might be for safety. Which is quite creepy looking. Look at the sky. Look how quiet. What actually does happen tomorrow. Because I think it's due tomorrow morning. So I'll get up early. I'll go out if it's safe enough. If it's not safe enough, I'll figure from my room. But I should probably get away from this area. But it's been raining most of the night, actually. The river's starting to get high already. So it's actually the day of the typhoon now I'm inside but it doesn't seem too bad it's quite windy but um, it's not that bad yet it is a little bit windy actually I think it's an evening when it's going to be in full force this thing's fell over already but I should probably close the window I'm just going to stand on the balcony it doesn't look too bad I might go try and go out with it. Yeah, I'm just going out with it now. It's starting to get worse. It looks a lot worse. But I've ordered a coffee, so I'm going to go try and get that now. There's like a load of metal poles and stuff, so I am going to have to be safe. It's like a heavy storm, like very windy, the rain's bad. I put some footage up as well. A lot of people are using the school I'm in. They're using it for like shelter, for people who have unsafe kind of accommodation. There's like hundreds of people staying in the gym of the school. So there's a lot of people on the campus. It's like being in quarantine again. I put my lunch outside the room, the breakfast, every single meal gets just put outside the room. But I went for coffee anyways. It's not that bad yet, I think it's going to get worse this evening but it's just rainy, like a big heavy storm at the moment like you can see around here but a lot of people are using the gym as well so you see hundreds of them just sat in the school so I'm not out in that main area of the building but it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be here uh, I'm still wet, I should go out with an umbrella at least but I say it's not that bad but I've only been out for like one minute and I'm soaked and wet already so it is actually pretty bad Three meals, some vegetables, some like hash brown or pork, some meat and some rice. So they deliver like three meals a day, so it's not bad actually, but it's not the best Chinese, it's like quarantine food. It's still nice of them to bring every meal and bring it to me, because obviously they've got to go out and bring it back, so it's dangerous for them. It's literally just put outside my doorstep, but I still go out for delivery, so I probably shouldn't take the meals. But it's not bad, it's... Chinese food, but it does the job. But yeah, now we're just gonna have to hold out. I've got the day off work tomorrow because it's like a summer camp, so they've closed the camp for the kids because obviously it's not safe. Um, but now I've just got nothing to do. There's no Wi Fi in the room, it's a bit boring. And I'm just, yeah, so yeah, I haven't got much to do. But the storm's gonna get worse later on, so I'll see if I can catch it and it's worse and it's strong. I suppose it's just for the safety of the school to shut the, shut the school. This is also the dormitory of the school. I'm just in the dorms. I wouldn't choose these curtains, don't worry. You can hear the window smashing as well. It is pretty crazy outside, to be fair. What I experienced in Shenzhen was a lot worse than this. It's not too bad. We'll see if it picks up or not, because it's a bit of a boring video. I'm literally just in the rain and wind. Yeah, the storm's been and gone. It was a little bit underwhelming, to be fair. Like, there's not really much damage or trees falling down. I shouldn't actually want that. I don't want that. But if you look around the surround areas, there's not really 
just been like a heavy storm, a lot of wind, a lot of rain. I think it's missed Shanghai. <coughs> I think it's missed like the part of Shanghai I'm in because I've got videos on WeChat, my friends on WeChat, and it's looked pretty bad where they are. Seeing windows falling out, like flooding. A couple of trees. Hello. Yeah, most of the trees have held strong. They're still up. They're pretty strong trees. All the leaves and branches and stuff have fell off. But it's not too bad. But it was a little bit underwhelming, it wasn't nowhere near as bad as I thought it was going to be. But everyone's safe, I got a day off work, I don't know if I get paid or not, but I got a day off work. There's not really much damage done. The people in my school, they're all still in the school, so they'll probably be going back soon, I think probably later on this evening. But yeah, that's going to be it from today's video. I know it was a little bit of a clickbait, but there was a storm here, but the storm was just shit. So if you did enjoy the video, I'm not dead, if you're disappointed, Drop a like, subscribe, and I will try to get more videos out. I am trying. See you all in the next one. Goodbye.